Hi, family. Welcome back to my channel. You are all warmly welcome. Thanks for returning, and I appreciate you all. Family, today on our menu, we have another breakfast recipe, and we're going to make oven baked French toast. And I'll show you two ways that I make mine at home. And I hope you'll be inspired. If it's your first time here, you are warmly welcome. Please don't forget to like, share, comment on the video, and I'll appreciate it. Without further ado, let's begin. Into the bowl, I'm adding my three eggs. This is the first egg that I'm cracking. Next is my second egg. And my third egg. After that, I'll then add one cup of fresh whole milk, half cup of whipped or heavy cream, and half cup of evaporated milk. Yeah. To it, I'll add my melted butter, which is about one and a half tablespoon full. To it, I'll also add my cinnamon powder, which is also about a half of a teaspoon full. I will then go ahead and add about three drops of vanilla essence and two and a half tablespoonful of brown sugar. At this point, as usual, you will start to mix everything until they are all nicely combined, making sure the sugar and the cinnamon powder are evenly distributed and well incorporated. Okay, after achieving that, you set it aside and then we come to our bread. First, I'm going to cut the end crust of the loaf of bread just like this, and then I'll cut them into jumbo sizes. You can as well cut them into thin sizes if that's what you prefer. Yeah, I will leave part of the bread for the next recipe. Okay, so keep watching and go nowhere. I'm going to soak the bread into the mixture just like so, and after that. I'll transfer everything on the tray like I'm doing and family adding the butter to the mixture is optional okay I added the butter to the mixture because I want to achieve a glossy French toast in the end and that's it okay so it's optional just do it or opt that out okay family please don't forget to like share comment on the video and I'll appreciate it all right so it's all done and it's going to my preheated oven all right and it should be done in about 30 to 40 minutes time. Whilst it's baking, let me show you how I make my eggless French toast. Into the bowl, I'm adding one cup of fresh whole milk as usual. You can as well add your whipped or heavy cream or just use the fresh whole milk. I've added half a cup of white sugar and now my nutmeg powder. And also now I'm adding my vanilla essence. And it's time to whisk everything together nicely until they are well incorporated. There's my whipped or heavy cream, but I'm not adding it today. So it's three ways. You can use only the heavy cream or you can use only the fresh whole milk or you can just combine both. Yeah. So let's put that aside. And now I've added butter to my tray. And I'm spreading it to cover the whole space as you all can see. In the first video, you all saw that I added the butter to the mixture, but in this video, I'm just adding the butter to my tray. So it's two ways. Just do any of this and you'll be good, yeah? So you soak the bread into the mixture and then you transfer everything onto the tray. And now they are also going into the oven to be baked nicely. I can smell the flavor of the vanilla essence and the nutmeg powder, and I love that. With the remaining mixture from the first recipe, I'm adding flour to make a pancake and I love the consistency here. Into the frying pan, I'm adding butter. Family, so far, if you're enjoying the video, please don't forget to give your girl a big thumbs up. Don't forget to share this video for others to see. Help your girl spread the word. And if it's your first time here, hey, I hope you've been inspired enough to join this amazing family so please don't forget to click on the subscribe button click on the bell button to receive updates from me whenever i upload new videos yeah and the blink of an eye our pancake is ready so very soon i'll check on our bread toast to see if it's also ready okay and 
Ta-da! Our bread sauce is here and it looks good and glossy, but not too glossy. And I love it. I love the color. It's so beautiful. Family keep on watching and go nowhere because you've not seen the outcome of the second recipe yet. And I hope you try them out and thank me later. Look how nice our pancakes are. And now let's add our salad. And family, if you've not seen the video of my Ghanaian pad salad yet, check the video out. It's playing on my channel and you'll be amazed. Isn't this beautiful? Isn't this healthy? Isn't this mouth watering? Look at that. It's so healthy to start your day with such kind of breakfast recipes. Family, don't just watch the video. Try this out and bring me the feedback, which I really appreciate it by tagging me on Instagram, commenting down below my Facebook and YouTube videos, okay? Mm, this is so yum, yum, yum. And it's also quick and easy to make. And you all can attest to it. You waste no time on this. So easy. And this is the second batch. It's also ready. And it's all nice and beautiful. I love the aroma. The flavor is amazing. It's not all that glossy like the first one, but it's okay because it's even healthier this way. You can pair this with your hot chocolate, orange juice, pineapple juice, mango juice, or any other juice of your choice. But today, I decided to go for soy drink and family. I love the combination. Such a healthy way to begin your day with. Oh, I'm so loving this. You can as well enjoy the French toast on its own. But as always, I share everything. Mostly I eat with you. So I love to add my salad. And as you can see, I'm making my sandwich. Beautiful, beautiful and so healthy. And to it, you can add your mayonnaise, ketchup, salad cream. That is also optional, okay? Once in a while, I add the salad cream and all that to my sandwich. And some other times, I do not do that. So, as I said, it's optional. Sometimes you eat based on how you feel on a particular day, yeah? So, that's it, family. I hope you have been inspired by the video. Please, for more of this. Follow me on Instagram, like and follow my Facebook page. Also, subscribe to my YouTube channel for us to build this amazing family together, okay? In addition, follow me on TikTok for more updates, yeah? Ooh, this is so delicious and I cannot just have enough of this. I'm so loving this. I've got to sit down to enjoy myself better. And yes, this is exactly what I need to do right now so that the breakfast can go down my body very well. Ooh, don't just watch the video. Try this out and thank me later. And if you do try this recipe out, don't forget to tag me on Instagram. Comment down below my Facebook and YouTube videos and I'll appreciate it. Lovelies, I hope you've been inspired for more of my videos. Kindly follow your girl on Instagram. Like and follow my Facebook page. Follow your girl as well on TikTok and Twitter for more updates. Thanks for watching. See you all again in my next video. Until then, stay blessed, stay safe, be cool, take care, and enjoy. Toodles. Peace out.